God has chosen to use the weak things of the world. He has chosen to use the things that are nothing. So when you say, well, I, I'm no good, I can't. God says, well, you're just describing your qualifications. That's exactly why I want to use you. That the excellency of the glory may be of God and not of us. Sister Abigail, Abigail Townsend Luff. She's traveling on the ferry. In those days, there wasn't a bridge at Fort Erie. And she's traveling on the ferry across from Fort Erie to Buffalo. And she has a bottle. And she sticks a tract in it and corks it and throws it over the side. And there's a businessman standing there looking at her with disdain. Like, what is she doing? That businessman, when he gets back to the office, discovers that that he has been double-crossed and, and he has no way of proving it. And he's going to go bankrupt and he's going to be publicly shamed. He goes down to the lakeside at Fort Erie and determines to commit suicide. You can't do it. And for several days he goes back, back, back. Eventually he gets a little rowboat and he rows out into Lake Erie. And he's sitting there, floating in this little boat at night in Lake Erie. And he's trying to screw up his courage to throw himself over. And he hears something hit the edge of the boat. And he leans over. And he sees it's the bottle that the lady threw in on the ferry. And he takes out the track. And he gets saved. Now, I'm not here to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, this is the most effective ministry you can... Right? If there wasn't a God in heaven who controls the winds and the waves and who moves the hearts of little old ladies to put a tract in a bottle and... Not a hundred bottles, one bottle, one tract. One desperate soul and one God who works it out. I've had the opportunity around the, the world to see ordinary Christians just like you and me doing things that the world disdains and they think, well, that's not going to work. No, it, it isn't. It doesn't work to smash clay pots and blow trumpets in the middle of the night. It doesn't work, does it? Go try it. It doesn't work. But God works. And God works through these weak and beggarly things. These things that they just don't seem to be the way to go about it. But somehow, that's what God is doing in the world today. That the excellency of the glory may be of God 